the late Shunira Oluwale Shuemimo, popularly known as SOS, started the race of life in the month of August and coincidentally ended same in the month of August. For the 71 years he was around, his footprints were quite indelible on the sands of time, as attested to by both the clergy and his associates who had gathered to relieve his memories one year after he is gone. You want to tell us that Baba Ijo has done wonderful things. He performed excellent things, and his name will always be remembered for good. He's gone, but his works forever remain. Particularly in this church, this it took this church from scratch to what it is today. Uh, was a great man. He lived well. And we're in this church now. The efforts he has put into this church. We can't quantify it at all. Believe me, even when we are burying him, we knew that. Uh, and as his family was joined by those who knew him so closely in thanking God for the continued repose of his soul, the officiating priest, Venerable Isaac Olaleye, said as so much was being said of the late Shorino Shuamimo's contributions in the vineyard of the Lord, the congregation needed to think deeply thus. <laughs> The church, Christ Anglican Church of Bayerin, where he was the Babaijo for little over three years, said its impact was quite indelible, even at the diocesan level, necessitating this posthumous award as received by his wife, Lady Evangelist Ajokeshu Wemimo, joined by other family members with one of the children, saying, I really want to thank you for your support, I want to thank you for your prayers, and it is our prayer that the Lord will continue to move the diocese forward. The late Shonira Oluwaleshu Wemimo, a veteran journalist, was among others, chief press secretary to five former governors, a three-time commissioner, Chairman of the Nigerian Union of Journalists, NUJ, and up to his death, Chairman of the League of Veteran Journalists in Ogun State. Additional Anidube, LGTV News.